Hey Cancers, welcome to your reading. I hope you guys are well. Did you have a nice birthday? I'm waiting for replies. <laughs> okay, if you're new, welcome. Please remember to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get all the messages I post each month. I'll leave information about what decks of cards I'm using and how to contact me for personal readings in the description box, okay? Sorry about that. <laughs> I don't know what just happened there. Something just started up about a criminal, so be careful. Um, maybe a message for some of you. Material, spiritual, material and spiritual prosperity here. Okay, six of wands there success coming your way now you should see a lot of positive movement and a feeling of overcoming difficult times okay uh, maybe a lot of people attracted to you at this time as well um just because you're coming at your birthday season and you know people want a piece of you let's see accelerated motion yeah things are really going to start going quickly now for you um the eight there is related to the strength card so during leo season we're going to see this accelerated motion here coming in for you guys let me get you some romance angels here and we'll see what's going on wedding okay so this seems to be on the cards a lot right um i feel like a lot of people are gonna meet the one um who they spend their life with from now i feel like people are just ready for a change in how relationships are at the moment people are looking for something long-term committed i think we've gone through this sort of era of everything quick everything right now and you know people was wanting fast and quantity now we're looking for quality over quantity i feel like it's that sort of time um so looking for somebody to marry here um this situation involves a wedding if you are thinking a lot about a past um wedding or relationship long-term relationship um you're gonna overcome that now okay um soulmate yes this is your soulmate so you're about to meet somebody here so you could even be asking look the person i was married to before was that my soulmate was that who i was supposed to spend the rest of my life with um you know did why can't i get you know find somebody who's going to offer this again or something um and you're going to get that now okay with this accelerated motion you will get this like spiritual prosperity here this overcoming this moving forward very quickly now with your soulmate um into a wedding wonderful let's get the tarot cards and see what's going on i mean wow you're really moving quickly now towards the soulmate could have felt like things was dragging for you so you could have even been single a long time after um a, a marriage or a very long-term relationship you may have stayed single a long time when i looked at the bottom of the deck it was children so maybe you stayed single because you had children to care for and now they're growing up or something it's time for you to meet somebody else here um the hanged one yeah being awakened i feel by this situation that you've been through here you could have felt stuck as well for a long time you may even feel it um like i'm not meeting somebody i feel stuck what can i do i can't get out um, i mean a lot of people can't get out with what's going on at the moment um how will i meet my soulmate will i meet my soulmate look at this differently um from a new perspective with the hanged man your soulmate ain't getting out either so they ain't meeting somebody else right um a new opportunity to learn technology um you know go to different places meet somebody in the park if the clubs or the bars or wherever we meet people are shut try a new place um i feel like just follow your heart here um what you enjoy go to those places and you'll meet like-minded people okay giving you a chance to meet people i feel like 
although we're moving forward, we're taking a step back with the relationships. We now want what once was. We want long-term marriages. We want forever. We don't want quick and everything like that. We want children. We want building, you know. So, yeah, look at it in a positive light here with the hanged man. Two of Wands. The choice is yours how you look at this. Um, but you're definitely at this crossroads now where there's beautiful opportunities coming. Um, no matter which road you take, you'll see amazing things happening here. Somebody's um, asking you a question to be or not to be. Somebody's missing you as well. Um, maybe you're just reminiscing about the way things were. Um, or somebody's reminiscing about the way things were with you here. Five of Cups there. Sorry, I'm looking down at the cards as I usually read them. My usual subscribers will know this is not my usual setup. Um, but I hope you guys bear with me and still continue to support me. Seven of Swords. Okay, so this can be low self-esteem. Um, negative thoughts here so I guess that's why the hanged man is asking like please change the way you're looking at this so you might be feeling a little bit like giving up at times I mean we all go through it you had the high of your birthday season and I guess for some people when we're having our birthday season if we don't really have somebody and that's what we want it can end up feeling maybe a little bit more sad and making us question, you know, what's going on with me? Um, why haven't I found somebody yet? Where's my soulmate? But again, like I said, this soulmate is coming and it seems to be like long term here forever. And I think we take um, quality over quantity, right? So maybe you haven't had a lot of people in your life because you want that long term. Maybe you've always been like that. Um, and you don't seem to be fitting in places, which means you can start feeling pretty sad, right? Um, because you don't sort of fit in in the world that's quick, now, instant, instant messages, instant deliveries, you know, instant food. Maybe it just doesn't fit you. Seven of Cups, yeah. So again, there's that feeling of confusion, sadness, and what Spirit's asking you here is, just look at this differently. Look at it as a, t a time to rest. Um, work on yourself. Ask yourself, what are these thoughts? You know, don't ignore them. Look at them, but clear them away and let them go here in order for new things to come in. So I feel like the challenges with you guys right now are more in your head. Like um, you're thinking negatively rather than a lot of negative things happening to you at this moment. I mean, negative things could have happened, but right now in this moment, it seems like it's more in your head and more doubt or confusion for you. Like I'm, I'm just doubting the whole process or I'm doubting this and I'm doubting that. Okay, six of swords, but don't worry, you'll start to move forward here, okay? Um, this is like a bump in the road. We're coming out of cancer season, all the you know, watery, emotional things, and then it'll be smoother sailing ahead. So I'm not overly worried for you here because it will get easier. Um, some of you may be traveling overseas as well, or somebody, your soulmate could be traveling overseas at this time to like your area, and that's why you haven't met them yet, okay? Six of Pentacles, another six here. The six is related to the lovers, but this is a lot of good energy coming in. Um, if you needing money and things like that, it's a good time to get like loans or things like that, mortgages, um, maybe even wanting to move long distance here. You'd be able to get a loan to do so, okay? You're getting, you're going to get that accelerated movement now. Okay, so don't worry. I know it's been slow going with the hangman. You feel stuck and that things haven't really changed for you. So it's made you start questioning, but you're going to start getting it now. 
nine of wands here yeah so what you need to look at is how far you've come you know don't say look how many times i felt say it like look how many times i fell and i got back up look how many times i felt that way and i got myself back up i've got me i did this be proud of yourself how far you've come all the challenges you faced in your life doesn't mean like anything but that you have strength and ability and are amazing here. So the nine of wands can feel like I'm blocked from moving forward. Like once I start to feel myself again, then the world's locked down. Who could have predicted that? Um, you know, so it's just sort of like conversations you're having with yourself. I want you to change like any negative into a positive. So if you have a negative thought, do me one favor today. Just think, what's the opposite of that thought? What could you say instead of that, right? So that's weeding out negative thoughts in your head. Um, the Nine of Wands is um, a soldier resting before continuing. So it's saying, it's not over for you. Don't worry, you will continue here. The Hierophant, again, another marriage card. So somebody hasn't come your way yet because it needs to be somebody long term. Um, here the divine sees that you don't want just anybody so this is why it hasn't worked out with anybody until now okay you had to learn this lesson and I think learn patience spirituality and that material things have no meaning here five of pentacles so as I was talking about material things just spend and save wisely some of you might need some sort of influx of money some help with money um, at the moment because it's saying you know spend and save wisely here but I think overall um, things are things are looking good you've just got to have patience and change those negative thoughts into positive ones and you'll get moving in no time good luck cancers